Hi, Dr. Brooks. Here's my last video vlog ever. Uh, first thing I wanted to say was just thank you for being an awesome professor. You've taught me so much, and I really appreciate all your guidance and support the last two years. So thank you. And wow, I can't believe it's already been two years, and I'm graduating in a week from tomorrow. It seems crazy. I feel like I was just in anatomy yesterday, but here we are. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to say that whenever I look back at my time here at Texas Tech, I'll always remember it with fond memories, and I'm really grateful that I chose to come here. I remember thinking when I first moved here how um, boring Lubbock seemed, um, having come from only ever living in the Chicago suburb and Phoenix suburb. Uh, it seemed like there wasn't much to do here, but when I got to know it, I realized that I was way off because it's an awesome city and an awesome school and awesome classmates, so I'm very grateful for that. Um, okay, now on to my clinical with the Dodgers. I just finished up yesterday was my last day, and um, it really went. I really went out with a bang, I feel like, because... Yesterday um, was my best day there, I think. Uh, we were playing, we were scheduled to play the Reds um, a couple cities over. And when we got there, the we, were, uh, we found out that the game was canceled because there had been um, a hazmat issue, I guess, with the pool guy. So we went back and we got to play... Uh, inner squad scrimmage on the stadium field so all our other games have been on the practice field the practice field so it was really cool my last day that we got to play in the stadium um at you know the spring training site that I grew up going to because the White Sox also share the same site with the Dodgers so that's the stadium I would always go to so it was kind of really cool to get to experience that on my last day sitting in the dugout out there and <clears throat> covering that game with the other athletic trainers. It was it was a blast. And then um, I have two more things to say. One is that looking back on these last five weeks that I've been here, I feel like I've learned so much, so, so much. And I, um, I have to thank the athletic trainers here because why I think I learned a lot, um, one of the reasons I think is because there are five athletic trainers here who all kind of practice a little differently, you know, have their own, have their own special things that differ from one another, so I think because of that I was able to really learn a lot, so I'm really appreciative of them. The last thing I wanted to say was just that I remember my first day with the Dodgers, one of the athletic trainers said that um, well, after I told him how I was, how I had been with the Texas Tech football team, he told me that he played football and he had um, worked football a lot when he was in school, but nothing beats the baseball atmosphere because it's the, everyone's like treated like family here, like it's a big family environment, and I they really made me feel that way yesterday, being my last day. Um, the Dodgers manager had me go to the team meeting and um, called me up and just wanted to thank me for it being my last day and everything. And then they even um, then presented me with some team gear. So I thought that was really awesome. Like I said before, I felt welcome since day one. And this is the first time at any of my clinical sites that they've done something like that on my last day. So it just really made me, um, just that environment really made me love baseball. And I know I've heard, working baseball, and I know I've heard from other baseball athletic trainers that that's common everywhere. Like, that's how it is everywhere. So it just makes me even more excited to hopefully be able to work for a baseball team in the future. All right, well, that's all I got for you. Um, I look forward to seeing you next week. Thank you.